hello there, kids. You two look like you just had a wonderful time. We were in an amusement park, and it's called Jungle World. Uh-huh, and everything looks just like the jungle. They even have mechanical elephants and tigers. That gives me an idea. We could build our very own amusement park with dinosaurs, and we could call it Dinosaur World. The idea, of course, is a good one. But where on earth are we going to find mechanical dinosaurs? We don't need mechanical dinosaurs when we've got real dinosaurs right here. <laughs> <laughs> For the construction, we can gather boards from the old barn. Here at the entrance, all of the visitors will be happily greeted by Chuck. Don't you think I should be at the entrance? Because obviously, I have the most charming smile. Uh -huh. eh? Wait a minute. I think that my smile is pretty charming. <laughs> Stop arguing. I will stand at the entrance. After all, I'm the most polite. Uh, thank you for coming, and I hope you have a nice day. Uh, uh. Is that what you call polite? I can be a hundred times more polite than that. You're welcome, please. And have a pleasant evening. Uh, uh. Thank you very much. Uh, good morning, and it's very lovely to meet you. Uh. 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 Hunky, Thor, uh. we're going to build a giant park. There will be space for everyone. The two of you are so polite, you nearly tore each other apart. I'm the one who should stand at the entrance. After all, I'm the most beautiful. Let's do this. Chuck and Unky, you can build the path and the bridge. Thor and I will work on the cave. Go, go, Turbozord! Today is the grand opening of the Dinosaur World Park, open to all. Please do not feed the dinosaurs as they are mechanical. <laughs> I wonder, who do they think is going to try to feed a mechanical dinosaur? Absurd. Let me remind you that when the guests arrive, we are mechanical dinosaurs, just like a robot. And you, Thor, try not to eat anything. Robots don't eat. What are you looking at me for? I already ate a big lunch and everything. All right then, everything is set. Peter, Katie, open the gates to our park. Welcome to our park. It's Dinosaur World. Hmm? Huh. Now, millions of years ago, dinosaurs inhabited our land, and they were enormous creatures, and... And they would eat whatever they wanted. <laughs> Hmm. Oh, but these dinosaurs in the park, they're not the dangerous kind, right? There's no need to be afraid of mechanical dinosaurs. Hmm. Hmm. Huh? <laughs> Whoa, will you look at that? That's a funny bird. Actually, that's not a bird. It's a pterodactyl. Did he call me a funny bird? I've never been so insulted in my life! Take this, you mechanical bully! I don't get it. I've been practicing, and that was my most charming smile. After us? 
It's all an illusion. But you told me that you had lunch. I did have lunch. Only ice cream isn't lunch. It's, uh, well, it's ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> Joe, Bull, Jerry, Unky, Thor, and Chuck, your Torbosaurus friends. Now they are on funny stickers in Viber. Join our channel and share your emotions with your friends. to bother you, but is there any way you can go next door to ask Mr. Charlie if he needs help? He's been working on something all morning. Yeah, no problem, Grandma. <laughs> Whoa, what are you making, Mr. Charlie? Well, more like unmaking. Taking apart this door. Don't worry, we're here to help out. Wonderful. I need to remove these boards. <laughs> that was easy. Glad that's done. Now I'll have space for a flower bed. Oh, and with these spare parts, I know what we can do. A birdhouse. A small wooden house for birds. Whoa, sweet! It helps the birds in the neighborhood and thanks them for singing so sweetly for us. Oh, that's so nice! We make homes for the birds and they return the favor by living here and being lovely. <sighs> There's a bird! <laughs> I think I hear your grandmother calling you. This board I'll bring with me. I almost forgot to give you this. Hang it wherever you like. Thanks a lot! Yeah, thank you, sir. It's so cool! We'll find a good place for it. I can't wait to show the Turbozors. The board, too? We'll figure something out. We've got plenty of time. <laughs> oh, good. A mailbox. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. It's for birds! For them to live? It's such a small, cute house. You know, I'm rather bird-like. I want a birdhouse. I guess we could build a birdhouse for Jerry. That's a great idea. How should we begin to do it? We'd need things like bricks, but I don't see any here. We might not have any bricks, but we've got wooden boards. We just need to pick them up. They're right outside old Mr. Charlie's house. Go, go, Turbozors! What? I ruined what now? Ugh. Oh, nothing! You made it much better! Mr. Charlie mentioned he wanted a place to plant his flowers. Flower beds are a piece of cake! I'm getting a ride. Another job well done. Go, go, Turbozors! Chuck, be careful. This is my house. A very special, important house. Huh? Ah. Ah. 
Mr. Charlie once said, he builds birdhouses, and in exchange, the birds give him music. Well, I am multi-talented, you know, but I've never tried singing. Make it stop. What? Was that not wonderful, Bull? It had a certain ring, like a cuckoo clock. And you don't need singing lessons to do that. Cuckoo! 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 <laughs> oh! The oh, lovely! Good job, kids. Cuckoo! Huh? Cuckoo! Hmm? Cuckoo! Strange bird. Been three hours now. I didn't even know cuckoo birds could do that. What are you guys so busy with? Just some spring cleaning. Our grandma's gonna let us go to the movies because we finished all our chores. Really? I wanna come. We've never been to the movies. We've cleaned enough today. I say we should take a break and go to the movies with you. Okay, but what about Chuck? Won't they notice him? I have a brilliant idea. I'll keep watch and yell out a warning if it looks like our cover's about to get blown. Hooray! Go, go, Turbosaurs! Movies! skills. Hi, kids. Are you going to the outdoor movie? You guys better hurry up now. Don't want to miss the trailers. Yeah, she's right. We'll miss the trailers. What's a trailer? Tickets left. Sold out. Oh, early bird gets the worm, I guess. Or the movie tickets. <laughs> Quick, go hide! <laughs> hmm? Hmm? Oh my, what impressive marketing they've done here. Any chance see a, a huge truck past that wall? Uh, or something? Huge truck? Over that wall? Mm, it looked like it was watching the movie. <sighs> we wanted to go, but we didn't get to see anything at all. Don't give up hope just yet. Follow me. I have an idea. <laughs> Yeah. 
This used to be something really interesting, the drive-in theater. People would sit in their cars to watch the movie. After the movie theater was built downtown, people stopped coming. But we can rebuild it. Clearly, one movie theater isn't enough. And if the audience is all cars... Brilliant! I see what you're getting at. In our car forms, we'll be able to watch the movies here and not have to hide. First things first. We'll remove the debris, plan a layout, and clear the area. Then we'll make a screen. Any questions? Go, go, Turbozords! Spot right there. Thanks, guys. This looks amazing. Now it's time to be an audience. You're both hard at work. So, what are you drawing? A big theater. And a dance show. Grandma, when's the last time you've seen one? Not for a long while. Mr. Charlie and I used to go all the time, but we don't get out to see shows anymore. But why not? Peter, let's put on a dance show for the two of them. Great idea. We could show them all the dancing that we've been learning at school. But where should we perform it? We'll need to find some kind of theater space. Let's build one. And I know who can give us a hand. Who could that be? But I don't know anything about theater. And I do not know anything about dancing. And I know even less than these two. How can we help? Mm. It's just like a movie, only it has live actors. And a stage instead of a screen. So let's work together and build a theater. I think I just found the perfect location for a theater. It's not all that far from Mr. Charlie's house. It's out in the woods, and it even has some abandoned logs that are covered with a tarp and are still in a good condition. Everything about it sounds perfect. Hooray! Go, go, Turbozords! thing we should do is clear this whole area. I'm on it. Let's yeah. do it. Don't forget that we need to leave space for the audience. Great work. Anki, why are you just standing there? Take those logs and set them up according to this diagram, please. Uh -huh. <laughs> Easy now. Those logs should all be aligned. Wow. Jerry, you're quite a prompter. There's no need for name calling, Katie. <laughs> Don't be offended. A prompter is an important job in the theater. They sit in a special hidden place and whisper instructions to the performers. Yes! I think I was born to be a prompter. So where will my special place be? I can't wait to start prompting everyone. Uh, almost. Ah. Oh my, a theater. Joe, so, how, how do you know, know about, about the theater? theater? My dears, of course I know about the theater. Since I was little, I have longed to be a grand diva. Pardon me, Joe, but just what is a diva? The most important artist. Huh? I've got it. Now I know exactly what I should call myself. I am the diva of all prompters. <laughs> That's enough. 
Grandma and Mr. Charlie will be here soon, and we're not ready. Right, we can't let them see the Turbozors. Listen, everyone, it's time to go and hide. But we don't want to leave the theater and hide. We want to be able to see the show, too. Luckily, I know just what to do. Hmm. <laughs> Peter, Katie, cover us up with the tarp. You can tell Mr. Charlie and your grandmother that we're extra sets on wheels. <sighs> you can watch the show from under here. Uh, I don't know about you guys, but I can't see a thing. Uh -huh. <laughs> There. Great. So sit quietly and enjoy the show from here. Thor, let's switch places. Then we can all see through the eye holes. They have no idea what's really under the tarp. Excellent work! What great dancers you've become! That was really something to see. I think I'll run home now. I want to make something special to celebrate your performance. I'll go help her. <sighs> that dancing was so awesome! I am so impressed! You two have real talent! I could never do that. I may be the diva here, but right now you two are the stars. Well, I was <laughs> disappointed. There was absolutely nothing for me to whisper. You two didn't make a single mistake. <laughs> <laughs> we'll catch lots of fish, and Grandma will cook them up. I bet I could eat two whole fish myself. Oh, yeah? Gotta catch them first. Wanna have a contest to see who can catch the most? Okay, I accept your challenge. Unbelievable! Look at all this litter! It's really awful! What a shame! Let's go find somewhere else to fish! Wait! We can't leave it like this! If we don't take care of the environment, then who will? So, what's today? Isn't it Wednesday? We won't be done until Friday! Not if our friends help out! Oh, hello. Looks like you've been fishing, but where are all the fish? There's a problem at the lake. There is so much litter, it's gross. We decided we had to do something. But we need some help. What are you two waiting for? Let's get our friends to help. 32. 33, 34, 35, 35. <laughs> Try and beat that. Huh? One, two, five, 45, I won. <laughs> you call that counting? That wasn't fair. What makes you say that? What number comes after 11? That's something like seven? Eight? That's what I thought. Bull, it wasn't on purpose. Hi, everyone. We sure need your help. There's a big problem at the pond. Wow. See? Ugh. Yuck. Don't worry. We'll clean it up. We'll sort it into what's biodegradable and what's not. Food waste is biodegradable. But plastic is not. It's important we separate the two. Bio what? Biodegradable. That means it will break down and decompose. <laughs> Food waste should be collected and buried. And as for the rest, let's place it in the correct bin. 
Chuck, please put plastic here and glass over there. <laughs> Bull, can you gather the rest into a pile? Uh -huh. Thor, can you dig a big hole? Then you and Unky will flatten it out. Jerry, can you coordinate us from above? But what about me? I want to help too. Once we bury the trash, you can help Unky and Thor level it off. Go, go, Turbozors! All clear! Hey guys, there's one more over on the left! My tires leave lovely tread marks. And that does it. Now Bull can deliver all these treasures to the appropriate bins. Don't forget, plastic and glass go in the recycling bins. Where's Chuck? The pond looks much better. It's time to fish. I thought you two might enjoy a boat, which I made. Chuck, you are a true genius. And all that I needed to construct this boat was one, two, eight, twenty, one hundred and twenty-seven bottles. <laughs> <laughs> Want to have a contest to see who can catch the most fish? I accept your challenge. did a super job. Now it's so beautiful here. Huh? What if people come here and litter again? Not to worry. I'll patrol from above, and if I see someone littering, then I'll get this signal to Chuck. You're up, Chuck. Now that ought to make people think twice about littering. Nice one. Hmm. I'm bored. What's everyone up to? Uh, yep. <laughs> <laughs> Good move, Chuck. You just might beat me at my own game today. Oh, cool. Did I win yet? Usually it takes more than one turn. <laughs> Pick the knight. Go. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Your move! Yeah. Yeah. Remember, Peter, a goalie's job is to never get distracted. What? Like that. Huh? I told you. You ruined both soccer and chess, Jerry. Those games are dumb. I'm bored and don't want to do either of those. Jerry, I know what you could do. <gasps> it's an old radio. From my grandma's attic. Mm -hmm. Look here. And later this afternoon, we yeah. should see some scattered clouds uh, come in, but no rain. Downtown, is we've got a traffic jam uh, leading up the Central uh, Expressway. Uh, Drivers are encouraged uh, to take a detour see? to the south. See? Now you can hear what's going on in town. Is your hair thinning? I've got just the thing for you. Well, check we should probably go check in with our grandma. Play soon? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> We got a bottle airplane. And Aunt Nora wants to try this thing out. Hmm. Huh? Ah. Remember.
Remember, kids, when trying something new, read the instructions first. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yep, got it. Boris, turn it on. <laughs> <laughs> it's not working. <laughs> Is it broken? Aunt Nora, you might need to release it. What? <laughs> <laughs> Boris, let your Aunt Nora see those oh. controls. I'm the one who read the instructions. <laughs> Looks like it's gone. Don't worry, we'll find your plane. Hmm. Hey, where did Jerry go? We have an important mission for him. Looks like it's gonna be another scorcher, folks. With oh, an does scorcher mean something other than fire? I know lots of baseball scores sun. now. Oh. oh, that beeping's new. That's a weird signal. It sounds like an SOS. SOS is a distress call. It means someone needs help. I bet it's a huge plane. Maybe it's in the storm. What should we do? We should build a safe place to land. <laughs> The plane's almost here. Thor, um, let's clear the field of rocks and stuff. Both, you can level the ground. Uh -huh. Chuck, you can help pave the runway. <laughs> Anki, uproot any tree stump. Joe, your headlights will make great runway lights for the landing strip. Go, go, Turbozors! Here, I see the plane. What's this thing? It's the plane, a toy. Thank you both so much. How did you find it? We just looked all over with help from friends. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. Ready? Here I come. <laughs> hmm? <laughs> <laughs> uh? <laughs> Thor, <laughs> Bull, uh? Unky, Jerry, Joe, <laughs> Chuck, and Katie. Nice try hiding from me, but I found you. And where is the little one hiding? Florian, where are you? That's one strange looking tree. Children, why are you all the way out here? Why? To play hide uh -huh. and seek. Strange, awfully strange. Hmm. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Whose turn is it to be it? I'm going to launch a drone, and that way I can get to the bottom of these mysterious events in our forest. Now, uh, which of these buttons do I push? <laughs> oh. uh. Wait, what? Hey, hey, hey. 
There you are. I've been looking for you everywhere. So strange. Where is Jerry gone? Oh, he's not gone. He's just stuck. We've got to find a way to help him. Hold on, Jerry. We're going to get you down from there. So maybe I just have to change out the battery? Or uh -huh. fix a spring? Or uh -huh. tighten a gear? Or maybe it's all of the above. the trajectory. Uh, uh, uh. Forgive me. I think I have a better idea to free Jerry. Now, if you'll step aside, please. Something in my head is spinning. May I please sit down? This way, if anybody else falls, it won't be so hard. I think I know why nothing has worked for us so far. Because we haven't had any breakfast? Hmm? Because we've only been working alone to save him, not together. And that gives me an idea. Go, go, Turbosaurs! <laughs> We'll start digging here, but first move the flowers over there. Chuck, bring that over there. And keep it coming, Thor. Thor, clear the space. Dig even deeper, Thor. Unky, we need your help with the cable. We're all set. Let's go, Joe! Pull now! That's not Jerry. And the trees seem to be so much shorter. <laughs> hey, I've caught the fugitive! <laughs> What are you doing? Playing hide and seek uh -huh. again? Uh-huh. Hmm. <laughs> Jerry! You won't believe the story of what happened to me. I'm minding my own business, taking a selfie. I gotcha! But only because these trees were in my way! It's a forest, Thor. The trees were there first. <laughs> it's okay, Thor. You'll catch up to them next time. You might just want to keep an eye out for the trees. They snuck up on me! Oh, do you hear that? It seems like they're building a new road. Now you're speaking my language. 
building. How I would love to be a part of it. It's okay to dream, Thor. But it looks like they have enough workers without us. Nothing is impossible, Bull. Machinery breaks down all the time, so they might find themselves in need of a backup. And that backup could be me? Exactly! So when the builders leave, Chuck will get rid of the gate. And Thor, Unky, and Bull, you just stay parked in the place where the other machines are. Jerry, you capture it all on video so that both Katie and I can watch everything happen from right here. So we're just gonna sit there doing nothing? I think that's what he said. That sounds like fun to me. Is everybody ready? Well then, go, go, Turbozord! working on a construction site. we will witness the payoff performance of our backup plan in action. And where is Thor? Thor's cool. He was entrusted with his own special section. has made a name for himself. Everyone's so happy with his work. And yet, someone else got all the glory. Danger alert! Danger alert! They want to send Thor to the shop! Send him to the shop? Well, we have to help him. It's such a pity. I had to leave the build at the most crucial of moments. Maybe this will make you feel better, superstar. Technology on the verge of fantasy! Haha! <laughs> I think I remember someone saying I eat too much. Well, I say that famous fantasy machines need extra food for extra energy. Speaking of food, it's time for lunch! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> hmm. 
Want to try it? I know you'll have a good time, Chuck. You really think that I could? You want to try and park that thing? Maybe for everyone else's sake. I'm trying. <laughs> oh. Uh, uh, uh. That hurt, Chuck. Oh, I'm sorry, Thor. These buttons are really small, and I have giant hands. Uh, uh, I'm afraid uh, we dinos just aren't suited to play with race cars, Peter. But I wanted to play a racing game. Uh, 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 hang on. We're all giant vehicles. Why don't we all have a real race? Uh, uh. How do you expect to have a race in the woods? And furthermore, we can't be on the highway. I got it. We could just build our own track here. Yeah. <laughs> I think there's enough room to build a track here, but it'll take some work. Here, look. It's okay if the track curves, but we'll have to clear out a bunch of rocks and plants and stuff. What do you mean, clear out plants? There's some great plants here. Don't tell me you'll move them. Lily of the Valley? Lily who? It's a flower in this field, even though they aren't blooming. It's an endangered flower here. So they're rare, like super rare. We have to protect nature, Peter. We'll figure something out to save them. We can transplant the Lily what's her face with soil. Bull, can you uproot the stumps? Mm-hmm. And Unky, can you help move them? Uh-huh. Thor, you can break up the soil to prepare for the road. Uh -huh. Joe, use your big tires to flatten the path. Hmm. Chuck, you and Katie can help move the flowers. <sighs> and Jerry? Jerry? Hmm. Jerry can nap. What for? Because this is your racetrack. I don't have wheels the way the rest of you do. I can't even race with you all. You can be the judge then. Really? The judge? That sounds important enough for me. I'll do it! Go, go, Turbozors! On your marks, get set, go! probably would have been first if I hadn't been shoved off the track. But you shoved me off, too. It'd be easier if I had wheels or treads. What do you mean, Chuck? Huh? You won because it's easier for you to win. I judge you all lose. I thought this would be a fun and fair fight today. I don't know. It's difficult because we all have such different skills. Oh, man. I'm sorry. But how do we make it fair? I know. There's a really simple way to make this more fun. Let me think. You can do it as dinosaurs. Sound good? On your marks, get set, and we're off! Well, of course Chuck would win. He's got the longest legs of us all. <laughs> Oh. Uh, Chuck, are you okay? Never better. 
Let the race go on. Huh? Looks like everyone won. What a great race that was. By the way, don't you think we should have some sort of aerial race next? With a wonderful prize for the winner? Yes? <laughs> Why are you all laughing? <laughs> don't you think it'd be fun? <laughs> Grandma, are you ready to pick the mushrooms? And berries, too? <laughs> you two go on without me. I fear I'm a bit too tired for an adventure today. <laughs> but it looks like the little one's all ready to go. <laughs> Peter, why don't we deliver the mushrooms and berries we pick to the people in town? Because most of them don't have time to go to the woods. Great idea. And why don't we ask the Turbozors for help? Let's go! Fantastic! You can count on the Turbozors all the way. Right, guys? Mm -hmm. <laughs> then let's go pick some mushrooms and berries. Can you believe it? There's enough to feed the whole city! Check out this cool-looking mushroom I found. I wanted to eat it, but of course I didn't because it's not for me. First of all, Jerry, the fly agaric is not for eating. And second, we need to build a warehouse to store and keep our harvest safe. Good idea, Bull. But first, I think we should make a building plan. This will be the conveyor belt. This will be for packaging, and this will be for loading. Everyone clear? All clear. This is where you all come in. We're going to need logs, rocks, and tree branches. Chuck and I will build the foundation. <laughs> Thor and Unky, you build the walls and the roof. Uh -huh. <sighs> go, go, Turbozors! And in the meantime, we'll keep watch over the mushrooms so that no one even thinks about eating them. Very impressive warehouse, everyone. And now, we can move on to packaging, and before you know it, we'll be ready for delivery. But how will we get them to everyone in town? Not to worry, Katie. That's a task for Jerry and Joe. Enough already! How will we carry them all? I said that's too many! What are you thinking? You can't be serious, Jerry. The baskets need to be filled to the brim. Yes, but I'm the one who has to fly to town and carry that heavy load. Let's see who gets there first. Good luck, guys! We believe in you! Ah, la, 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 Ha! It looks like I'm way ahead of Joe. Plenty of time to rest for a refreshment. What happened, Jerry? Do you need help? Oh, no, no! I'm just checking to make sure that none of these mushrooms are the fly agaric. But you know that the fly agaric is red with white polka dots. Now, Catch up. Uh, so much for being ahead. Uh, uh, wait, wait for me! 
Mushrooms and berries? From the woods? Oh, what a nice surprise. Thank you. Ah. Huh. Shoo! Shoo! Don't you know I'm in a rush? You're welcome. <sighs> It's a miracle! It's raining mushrooms! That's no miracle! It's the fast and reliable delivery of forest gifts from me to you! Enjoy yourself! I've got to rush to get home before Joe does! Thank you, Joe. I confess, I was rushing to beat you home, and look what happened. No one loves to race more than I do, but sometimes it's better if you take your time. When you do a job, don't rush and make sure you do everything carefully and correctly. Now, let's go home. 